Hey, Connie Knox here with Genealogy TV, helping you go further, faster, factually with your family research. Today's tiny tip is about Ancestry.com and their hints. Special shout out to Krista Cowan who uh, taught me this tip, but I've got an extra little trick on top of it. So one of the things that uh, they tell you at Ancestry.com is that the hints, those little leaves next to your family research uh, only serve up about 10% of the records that are available on Ancestry.com. So consider going to the card catalog. So we go over to the card catalog from your home page, go to the search tab, go down to card catalog. But before you do, think about your research question. So in my case right now, I am looking for Henleys, the surname Henley, in Randolph County, North Carolina in the 1880s. So I've got a place, a name, and a, a time frame. So if we go to the card catalog and we get at this point 32,000 records to play with before we even try uh, to do anything. And of course that number is going to change every time we uh, talk about Ancestry because they're uploading constantly. So if we scroll down to the United States and then we scroll down to North Carolina, if you stop right there and take a look at how many records are left, we've got 7,552 record groups. Okay, if we scroll down, we could continue to page through all of those records, but we can narrow this down a little bit further. We have the United States, North Carolina. If we scroll down, we're looking for Randolph County. There's Randolph County. And at this point, there is only one record group. I could actually dial this down to the 1880s, which is where I'm looking, and I still get that same one record that results. So I'm looking for Henleys. Reminiscences of Randolph County is a manuscript. If I type Henley in here and hit search, Sure enough, there are Henleys listed in this manuscript, and quite frankly, these are some of the founding fathers in Randolph County. So I just wanted to give you that quick little tiny tip from Genealogy TV. If you like what you see, hit the subscribe button and ring the bell so you get notified of the next time I upload videos. Talk to you later.